and chip them. It's like a tiny oh. little stag do, but like oh, a Oh, that seems lovely. Like, it's yeah. nice for them to have a thing because you know, the girls yeah. always get ready, yeah. and then for the guys, it's yeah. like, so there is absolutely not a single thing I would change about my sister. To me, she is pure love personified. It exudes from her and she pours it into every person she meets. I'm sure everyone here has experienced it, whether it's a hug right when you needed it, a squeeze of your hand, a beautifully decorated birthday card with drawings of your favorite things, a crystal that she's chosen just for you, or simply a compliment she gave you that you think back on for years to come. She's a very special human, and yes, I'm biased, but I'm also right. <laughs> there is no one on earth that I'd want beside me during everything that life has brought my, our way. And as cheesy as it is, the pressure of every tough moment has only made her into a bright, shining diamond of a person. So firstly, a toast to the angel on earth that is my sister, Sophie. <laughs> We all feel so blessed to be here in this incredible setting. It literally feels like we are part of something extremely special. This small collective group of very random people coming together to share your special moment. I think it's fair to say that they've created a truly magical and unforgettable experience for us all. I promise to listen when it's hardest to hear. I promise to be honest even when the truth is hard to bear. I promise to reach for you when you need it the most. I promise to support and encourage you in everything that you do. I promise to communicate even when it's hard to find my voice. I promise to work with you even when the path isn't clear. I promise to be vulnerable even when I am scared. I promise to hold on to the respect in our relationship. I promise to cherish you even when I don't feel whole. I promise to share with you even if my head says telling me different. I promise to trust you even at times when I don't trust myself. And I promise to love you wherever well, this journey may it. take us. That's too early again. That's beautiful. I'm lucky to call John my business partner and best mate. He's always there to listen and support. And occasionally stick his finger up my bum <laughs> or grab my nipple as he walks past. The muscles into the It's the small things. I've been privileged to be a part of Sophie and John's journey together. Witnessing the way they communicate, support, and love each other is simply beautiful and inspiring. I can't wait to share the rest of your story together. Lahayan. The nearest and dearest to John and Sophie, I have a question, and if you agree, please respond with the rousing we do. Do you promise to be there in good times and in bad to love, guide, and support this magical couple? Excellent. <laughs> Today, as you join in marriage, there is a wild and beautiful future stretching out before you. You entered as individuals, but you'll be leaving here as husband and wife. You're embarking upon a great adventure, and we all know you'll enjoy every bit of the ride. By the power vested in me, which isn't much, <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. Woo!